Hi, I'm Robert Ring with OS Training, and thank you for joining me for our introduction to Magento 2. Thanks also to Nexus, who has sponsored this series and is providing the server space and hosting environment for the demonstration site I'll be using throughout the tutorial. In the next video, I'll explain why it's extremely important to find a web host that specializes in Magento hosting for those who plan on running a site built on any version of Magento. But for now, let's talk briefly about Magento itself. Magento is a content management system built specifically for e-commerce websites, especially medium to large scale sites where you need as much automation, as much flexibility, and as many features as possible. It can at times be a difficult platform to learn, but its benefit is that as opposed to other content management systems like Drupal, which can absolutely be customized to become an e-commerce platform, Magento is built from the ground up with the single purpose of being an e-commerce platform. While there are extensions that provide more functionality than what Magento comes with out of the box, Magento comes stock with all of the basic things you need to get a store up and running on the web. And it provides a wide range of flexibility regarding the different types of products you may need to sell, as well as accommodating many different ways in which you may need to structure the listing and details of those products. Magento 2 comes in several different forms, it comes in a free community version and paid enterprise versions, the latter of which provide additional features and support. For this tutorial, we will be using the free version. In this tutorial, we're going to work with the example of an online store that sells coffee products. So if you plan on running a sizable online store and are considering Magento 2, this tutorial will introduce you to the CMS and show you how to get started from installing it to configuring your site and getting it ready to go live. Let's get started.